Hey, how's it going guys? So today we're going to be opening up a, a 22 inch tabletop griddle made by Members Mart, uh, basically Walmart, Sam's Club's own brand. So let's go ahead and get started. <laughs> So the taller side, basically where you got these washers in, is gonna be the back side. And there are four holes on each corner of the base. And these legs will go inside those holes. There you go. Now we're gonna put this trap drawer here. Let me just push it up a little bit. It's right here in this corner. There you go. And this is the drain hole where you can uh, scrape basically uh, the leftovers and you know all the 
messy stuff and you can just dump them in here and this trap drawer is gonna actually catch it. That's the mold again. So now there's this uh, rubber piece that we're gonna pull out. It's just a cover. It doesn't have any threads or anything like that. So you can just pull it out. And next thing we're gonna hook this uh, propane uh, connector right over here. can adjust it it actually rotates so you can adjust it to your preference when you're hooking up the propane tank uh, you want to make sure it stays preferably in this angle you don't want to put it this way like this upside down or you know any other way it's just according to the manual um, they recommend to a uh, propane tank to be hooked up like this preferably so that's that um, and um, otherwise, yeah, and by the way, this uh, there's this little stick can be used to actually a lot of light up the burners. Let's say if the igniter actually broke or something, if it's not working, you can actually use this to light up the burners. Uh, otherwise, when you don't need it, there's a little hole uh, where you can just pretty much slide it in and then it just stays out of your way. Um, and one last thing before we wrap up this video uh, to turn it on. You just rotate the knob and it lights up as such. Put it this way so as you can see other one side is already lit up. So just rotate it. There we go. And then you can adjust the knobs, um, the light preference. You can lower it, put in a medium, whatnot. And turn to, to turn it off, you just rotate it back. Push it and rotate it back and then it shuts off. There we go. Uh, one last piece that's left is actually this cover. So this grill actually does come with its cover from the factory so you don't have to buy it. Um, this is supposedly all weather. Um, and yeah, I mean, let's try to put this on. <music> and snug actually you probably don't want to pull it too hard down because um the edges of the grill are sharp i mean they're quite pointy so you can actually poke a hole on this uh on the cover so you don't want to pull them too tight down but uh but like i said i mean it's already rubberized uh around it actually stretches and that's it and whenever you don't need it, you obviously can't remove this propane connector here. It actually just twists right out and you can just um, store it underneath the cover or something. And whenever you need it, you can basically just hook it back up and then connect your propane tank. And thanks for watching. You guys have a wonderful day. Bye.